An IPO is when a company, for the first time, uh, turns to the public markets to raise uh, capital by, the, by selling common stock. It's the first time for investors, really, to participate in the ownership of the equity of the company. In the period before the formal IPO process starts, the company goes through a bake-off period. They approach a number of investment banks, in Wall Street and they have talks with them and they try to pick the banker that will best serve their interests not only in the IPO per se but also in the long run as a relationship uh, investment banker. The most uh, likely candidates to get that job would be the big names, what we call balls bracket investment banks. Uh, currently that will include names like Goldman Sachs, Morgan Stanley, Bank of America, Mary Lynch, JP Morgan Chase, uh, Credit Suisse, Deutsche Bank, Citigroup. And um, in this case, uh, Facebook uh, decided to go with Morgan Stanley. And Morgan Stanley uh, was the number one and the number two um, IPO uh, underwriter in the area of internet uh, IPOs. And along with Goldman Sachs, has dominated, at least the last year, uh, the underwritings of IPOs uh, globally. Morgan Stanley also has the advantage that it is a very well balanced investment bank. Not only can approach institutional investors for the wholesale placement of the issue, but through its old Dean Witter network of uh, brokers and uh, the recently acquired uh, network of brokers of uh, Smith Barney, they have uh, <clears throat> thousands if not millions of accounts, many mutual funds uh, where they can place uh, the new securities. And in the case of Facebook, being a very popular and well-known company, what we would call a people's company, I believe that the retail placement is very high in the priorities of Mark Zuckerberg and uh, therefore Morgan Stanley from this point of view was an excellent choice. Only the names, the corporate names of the investment banks appear and the name that we see in the left side of the cover page of the prospectus is that of the lead or book running manager at investment bank that will take the lead role in running the IPO. And that's where the Morgan Stanley name will appear. Next to it, we are going to see the names of co-managers. And in the order at least those names have appeared in the press, will include JP Morgan Chase, Goldman Sachs, Bank of America Merrill Lynch, Barclays Capital, and even a smaller, I would call boutique, uh, underwriting company, Allen Company.